Hey guys, it's the captain here from Anderton's TV. We just found Tosin Abassi, and uh, you just launched a guitar company, which is crazy. Yeah. Um, so tell us what, why, why you did that. Um, I've had a very long relationship with a conventional sort of artist and large guitar manufacturer, and I think you know the relationships I've built basically illuminated that I had all the moving parts to actually like strike out on my own with this design that I actually conceived of and create a situation where we could offer all these iterations to consumers instead of just one model they get six seven eight headless fanned wood choices pickup choices made in the USA you know top luthier quality so it just seemed like it was perfect timing I can tell just by looking at it this is a premium piece of kit here yeah, it's not um, bad. Uh, I, I mean it looks a little like the, the, the last Ibanez kind of one. Is this a shape that you're very familiar with? And it's a shape that I conceived of. Right. Yeah, and so I was prototyping with Ibanez, and it was a, close to a three-year process, and a lot of that is because of um, the process. Yeah. You know, it's not exactly like a small operation. Yeah. It's a, a huge international, a lot of moving parts. So sure. there, as amazing as Ibanez is, I've been with them for 10 years, there was a bit of frustration, and I realized I wanted to do things on a smaller scale. And so they were gracious enough to give me the opportunity to prototype, but I, I realized that uh, to fully realize what I wanted, I, I probably needed to kind of create my own situation. Well, that's cool. And in terms of, you know, when you're a younger guy learning to play, I'm kind of I, I see I see your stuff, and, and you're sort of pioneering a relatively new style. But were you like a Stanley Jordan kind of fan, or what? what where, where yeah, you? yeah. I mean, it's the usual suspects. Stanley Jordan's maybe not known by everyone, but yeah, his touch style was yeah. like him and Victor Wooten had approaches yeah. to tapping that I just found like really like intriguing, especially when you have a ton of strings. But I was a huge John Bertrucci fan, Ingve Malmsting, yeah. Steve Vai, um, Greg Howe, Frank and Bali. Like I was consuming all of their instructional material, and if you match all that together with a bit of Kurt Rosenwinkel and Adam Rogers, some jazz harmony, you, you kind of get what I'm doing now. Well, you're in a total league of your own as a player, so can you give us a little bit here just so that we can see what it sounds like? Oh, wait, yeah. So we saw the eight a second ago, the six, and the non-fan fret, a little bit more conventional looking. Um, yeah, talk us through this one. Yeah, you're totally right. So this is uh, our first six string guitar. We went with a traditional, you know, fret, fretted situation. It's not compound, multi-scale. We have a mini Floyd Rose here. Yep. Um, we've had Guthrie uses on this. Yeah, and, uh, yeah. See, I, I remember when I first saw that on his, and, and it's like, how did this go out of production? It's just such a it's such a great trim system. It's like, perfect, you know. Um, and I, I like trims. It's it's hard to find them in a, a multi-scale eight-string situation. But on a six, you have all the options you want. But we like the Guthrie, the Mini Floyd. So you've got that. You got a tone knob, and then we went with a poplar body actually. And uh, oh, this, this is, is stunning. It's pretty Look cool, huh? It's a two-piece roasted flame maple neck. <laughs> so we, we we don't do the whole like multi-laminate thing. It's just like book match two pieces of wood. Um, and then we have this uh, trans, like, pearl white, pearlescent white finish on here. It's very nice. Yeah, and you got a flame maple fretboard there. Oh, this so, is classy. I like the way you got the logo here is instead of here. It's just yeah. it's nicely done, man. I appreciate that. It's very cool. Yeah. Well, thanks for showing us that as well. So yeah, thanks, thanks for coming, man. Take yeah. it easy. All right, anyway, yeah, see you soon. Yeah.